so much to learn about. It'll make you want to shout, Mika! Hey, it's me, Mika. And today I'm at Billy Bee's in Anaheim, California. Billy Bee's is an indoor playground, so it's a great place to play and have fun and use our imaginations. Come on! Whoa! Hey, it looks like we're in a town. We could definitely use our imaginations here. <gasps> Wait, this looks like a mailbox. Huh, I actually have something I need to mail. A note for my grandma. <laughs> there you go. Nice. Whoa, come in here. Hey, we could imagine that we're at a grocery store. Yeah, have you ever been to a grocery store before? To pick out some yummy food? Hmm, let's see. Ooh, waffles, that's yummy for breakfast. There's lots of breakfast food here. Cereal. Ooh, 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 ooh. Oh, cheese crackers. And a mini pretzels. Let's go, need to pay for it. <laughs> okay, I'll just ring myself up. Okay, let's see, what do we have here? Cheese crackers, okay. And we have some cereal. Oh, quite a deal. I love this store. Waffle, and pretzels, okay. Looks like it's, oh, only three dollars? Wow. Okay, looks like I can take my snacks and go home. <laughs> oh, it's so fun to use your imagination, right? All right, well, let's keep playing. I wonder what else is in this town. Hmm. Hey, this looks super fun. Oh, come in here. We could imagine that we're in school. Whoa, a clock. So colorful. <laughs> Will you count with me? Okay. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, oh, <laughs> nine, ten, eleven, twelve. <gasps> it looks like it's time for school to start. We better get to class. <clears throat> Everyone settle, settle, settle. Hello, I'm your teacher, Teacher Mika. Okay, today we are going to learn how to count strawberries. Ready, class? <clears throat> A one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Ten strawberries. Good job. <laughs> oh, what's this? Look at this. I see a pattern. Blue, yellow, red. Blue, yellow, red. Blue, yellow. Do you know what's next? That's right. Red. Whoa. <laughs> well, it looks like Class is over, everyone. You deserve a break. Go outside and play. <laughs> All right, how else can we use our imagination? What's this? Oh, interesting. Hmm. Looks like some toy tools and instruments. Hey, these are all things that doctors and nurses use, like a stethoscope. Let's check my heartbeat here. Maybe you would wear this name tag so everyone would know what your name was. Dr. Mika. <laughs> That's cool. And nutritious nibbles for healthy and happy kids. <laughs> That's really funny. Looks like pretend vitamins or something. Oh, have you ever seen a tool like this? Sometimes 
sometimes doctors use something like this to check your reflexes. Let's check my reflexes. <clears throat> All right. Usually they hit you in the knee right here. Ready? Whoa! Did you see that? Let me try the other leg. <laughs> I have really good reflexes. <laughs> All right, I'll put this back. <sighs> it's so fun playing. I wonder what else they have here. Come on. Whoa. Hey, look over here. Even with basic shapes, you can use your imagination. Like, come down here. <gasps> this is a my dog house. I have a dog in here. Do you want to say hi? Okay. Come on out, Rover. Oh. oh, he's sleeping, taking a little nap. Oh, <laughs> hey, and I could pretend that this is a trampoline. Will you bounce with me? Okay. Whoa, whoa. <laughs> this trampoline is awesome. Whoa. <laughs> oh, and we could pretend that this is a mailbox. Oh, I got a note back from my grandma. Dear Mika, thanks for the note. See you next Saturday for our tea party. Oh, she's so sweet. <laughs> okay, let's see. Uh, we could pretend that these blocks are my next door neighbor's house. Let's put some blocks here together to make a house. Whoa, I like this one. Do you know what color this is? Yellow, one of my favorite colors. And it's a one, two, three, four, square. <laughs> nice. Okay. Hmm. I'm gonna put it like this. And here's the roof. This is my neighbor's house. I'm just keeping an eye on it while they're on vacation. And ooh, come with me to the rainforest. Maybe we could ride our Skateboard through the rainforest. Whoa, this is so fun. Whoa. <laughs> whoop, whoop. Whoa, what is this? Maybe we could zip line through the rainforest. Woo. <laughs> and we could pretend like we're worms and dig through the dirt. Here we go. It's so much fun to use your imagination. Do you want to play some more? All right, let's do it. Over here. Look, a circle. Oof, I'm going to crawl through. Hello. Another circle, see? Whoa. <laughs> hmm, I wonder what's down here. Hey, we could imagine that this as a colorful snake or a macaroni necklace. Have you ever made a necklace out of macaroni? <laughs> and I notice a pattern. See, maroon, yellow, maroon, oh, excuse me, <clears throat> yellow. So cool, right? Oh, excuse me. It also kind of looks like ketchup, mustard, ketchup, Mustard. <laughs> Whoa. <laughs> hey, I see a yellow slide. Hello. Hello. <laughs> and I think there's one down here too. Yeah, a green slide. Hmm, which slide should I go down? Yellow or green? Yellow or green? <gasps> yellow or green? Hmm, I think green. Hey, will you meet me at the bottom of the slide? All right. See you there. Whoa, <laughs> that was so fun. Hey, let's imagine that these are colorful logs on a rushing river. Okay, let's see if I can get to the top without falling in the water. Can I do it? I got this. I got this. I got this. I did it. <laughs> oh, it's over here. 
Whoa, check this out. Maybe this is a big vine that we have to get past, but it's always in the way. Whoa. <laughs> Come on. Hey, look, more logs on the river. Whoa. <laughs> this is so cool. Come on. More logs. Oh, have to be careful. It's going down the water. <laughs> oh, I see another big vine. We're coming for you, vine. Whoa. <laughs> Pretty good, huh? <laughs> what else is over here? Oh, I see something. I have to go get it. Goodbye. <laughs> I had so much fun with you today at Billy B's. It was really cool using our imaginations. Remember, we pretended to go to school, pretended to be doctors, we went to the grocery store. Oh, I wrote a letter to my grandma and she wrote back right away. <laughs> I had such a good time moving my body and playing. Thank you so much for learning with me today. Well, this is the end of this video, but if you wanna watch more of my videos, all you have to do is search for my name. Will you spell my name with me? Cool. M-E-E-K-A-H. Mika. <laughs> All right, I'll see you next time. Oh, bye. <laughs>and today I'm at Dig It in Torrance, California. They have so many cool construction toys here like excavators and conveyor belts. Oh, I'm going to pretend to be a construction worker. But first things first, safety first. I'll put on my hat and my safety vest. <laughs> Will you pretend to be a construction worker with me? Great, come on. <laughs> I'm at my first construction vehicle. Can you guess what it is? <laughs> I'll give you some hints. It has two arms and a bucket. <laughs> That's right, it's a front loader. <gasps> Check it out. <gasps> okay, let's see how it works. <gasps> oh, start engine. Start. <gasps> wow. <laughs> let's honk the horn. Turn on my lights. And check out these pedals. Whoa! This is so cool. <laughs> okay, let's park. <laughs> that was awesome. Ooh, and look at these big tires. Black and yellow. One of my favorite colors. Oh, let's see what this does. Spin, spin, spin. Whoa. So cool. We can roll it around. This is a big circle. Easier for rolling. <laughs> and these are called treads. They help the wheel get traction. <laughs> and check this out over here. Oh, wow! It's like a construction site. <laughs> and there are three construction vehicles. Red, green, and blue. Oh, and it's a puzzle. The goal is to get each car to its sight. This one is for the blue car. Okay, let's see if we can get it over. Hmm. Da, da, da. Hmm, best way to get there. 
Excuse me, Red. Da, da, da. Oh, I have to go up there. Excuse me, Red. You go down there. Da, da, da. <laughs> we made it. Okay, let's try for Red. <laughs> da, da, da. Which way will we go? Huh? No, that's not the right way. <laughs> da, da, da. <gasps> we made it. Okay, one more vehicle to go. Da, 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 da. <gasps> Whoa, we did it. We matched all the vehicles. That was so awesome. <gasps> oh, check it out. I see something cool over there. Let's go. Whoa, check out this building. It's pretty tall. Oh, and it has a lot of great shapes. Do you know what this shape is? That's right, a triangle. And this shape? Circle, great job. Put this triangle on top. Make sure everything's nice and tight. Hey, let's use this pipe wrench to make sure everything is tight. Nice and tight. <laughs> Great! I have another wrench in my jam pack. This one's called a crescent wrench because of the shape on top. <laughs> it kind of looks like a moon in the sky. <laughs> Okay, let's take our tools and see what needs fixing over here. Whoa, check out these big blue buildings behind me. Woo <laughs> so tall. Hey, let's make an M together. Oh, and look, I have the perfect shape for that. Don't they look like rainbow arches? <laughs> yeah, okay. Awesome! Now I have a second rainbow arch. <laughs> wow! An M for Mika. <laughs> Job well done. Okay, our project is constructed and finished. On to the next one. We made it to the cement truck. Mix it up, mix, mix it up. Mix it up, mix, mix it up. <gasps> wow. Oh, ho, ho. <laughs> whoa. <gasps> hey, this looks like a hamster wheel. That's a wheel that little hamsters and other animals use to run around and get their exercise in. <laughs> but in construction, this wheel is used to mix cement. It turns it around and around and around, mixing it all together. <laughs> Should we try it? Should we be cement that gets mixed and mixed and mixed together? <laughs> yeah, let's give it a try. <laughs> that made me a little dizzy. <laughs> Spin, spin, spin like a cement truck. Spin, spin, spin like a cement truck. <laughs> I saw a lot more cool things to do here while I was spinning. Come on, let's go learn more about construction vehicles. Beep, 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 burr. <gasps> We made it to our next construction vehicle. Can you guess what it is? I'll give you some clues. It has an arm and a boom and a bucket. That's right, it's an excavator. <laughs> Excavators are used to dig things up. Sometimes it's dirt, but this excavator digs up balls. Okay, we have to stay out of the construction zone, okay? <laughs> oh, here we go. <laughs> Yay! <laughs> awesome! Let's try it again.
fine. We dug up a lot. Our job here is done. Okay, let's go. <laughs> Look, it's a conveyor belt. A conveyor belt helps construction workers move things from one spot to another so that they don't have to carry them. <laughs> Great. Oh, and look, check it out. Look at all these bricks. <laughs> They're rectangular. See the shape? <laughs> and do you know this color? <laughs> yeah, brown. Oh, and there's another shape too. Can you see it? <laughs> right, circles. Let's count the circles. One, two, three. Great job. Mmm, <gasps> this kind of reminds me of chocolate. Let's pretend that these are chocolate pieces and we want to move them way up there. Come on, let's check it out. Okay, let's put them on the conveyor belt. Mm-hmm. Great. Ready, little chocolates? <laughs> turn, turn, turn. Whoa! Wow! I have to keep turning, have to keep turning. <laughs> Whoa, let's get them all the way to the top. There they go! <laughs> Yeah! Okay, now we're at the top. At the bottom, we put the chocolate bricks onto the conveyor belt and we turn the wheel, turn the wheel, turn the wheel until they went all the way to the top. And look, this is where they landed. Oh, more bricks are coming. Check it out. Oh, whoa. <laughs> that is so cool. <laughs> Okay, now I'm ready to go down the slide. I'll see you at the bottom. Woo! Woo! <laughs> yeah! That was so much fun! Whoa! What's this? Hmm. It kind of looks like a bucket. Oh! Check it out! When I pull this one down, that one goes higher. Oh! It's a pulley system. It helps get things from one place to another, just like a conveyor belt does. <laughs> Maybe I can send my friends some lunch at the top. <laughs> but since I don't have lunch, let's see what I have in my jam pack. Oh, look, a little construction vehicle. Let's put it in the bucket and send it up. <laughs> Ready? Here you go. <laughs> Let's put something in this bucket too. Let's see what I have in my jam pack. A tiger. Are you ready? <laughs> ready. In you go. Have fun. Woo! <laughs> wow! Now the tiger is going up high. And now it's coming down low. <laughs> now it's going up high. <laughs> and look. Our construction vehicle is on the other side. Wow, being a construction worker is a lot of fun. Okay, let's drive away. Wow, a tractor race. Since I'm all done with my construction work, let's go on a tractor ride. Whoa, 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 in my big tractor. Go, 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 in my big tractor. Beep, beep, backing it up. Vroom! Whoa, that was so much fun. <laughs> Thank you so much for being a construction worker with me today. We rode a big front loader and we pretended to be cement mixing around in a cement mixer. Then we used the little excavator to dig up a ball pit. 
<laughs> Whoa, we did a lot today. Now it's time to hang up my vest and roll on out of here. Well, that's the end of this video. But if you want to watch more of my videos, all you have to do is search for my name. Can you spell my name with me? <laughs> M-E-E-K-A-H, Mika. <laughs> okay, bye-bye. See you later. Hey, it's me, Mika. And I'm so excited because today we get to meet someone very special, Sean Johnson. <laughs> John is an Olympic gold medal gymnast. Gymnastics is a cool sport where you get to do lots of fun things with your body. It takes a lot of practice, strength, flexibility. <laughs> and Sean is gonna show us some cool moves at the Nashville Gymnastics Training Center. I can't hardly wait. Woohoo! here we go. Woo! <gasps> oh, hi. <laughs> hey, Sean, I'm Mika, nice to meet you. It's so great to meet you. <laughs> you too. Will you show us some gymnastics? I would love to, but first we need to stretch and warm up to stay safe. Oh, right, cause yes. first things first, Safety first. Yes. So let's stretch your arms first, just kind All of right. across. Arms first. Yes. <laughs> How old were you when you started doing gymnastics? I actually started gymnastics when I was two years old. Whoa. I came into the gym and I just got to run around and I loved it. Oh, that sounds so yes. fun. Yes, it's kind <laughs> of like a playground, mm -hmm. but it's really soft and cushy so you can do a lot of flips and stuff and stay safe. Oh, that's so yeah. important. Let's stretch our legs next, right okay, here. Sean. So grab the back, it takes some balance though. So. Whoa, you're really good at balancing. Yes, how, a lot of practice. Yes, how often did you practice? So when I started at the age of two, I only went for like one hour, one time a week. But as I got older and I got better at it, I kind of went more and more hours. Wow. Um, because it takes a lot of practice to go to the Olympics. It really does. Yes. And how many Olympic medals do you have? I have four Olympic medals. Oh. I have a gold on the balance beam, and I have a silver on the floor, and on the team, and on the all around. Whoa. <laughs> yes. What are the differences between the medal colors? Yes, so the gold is number one. It's like the first place, and silver <laughs> is number two, second place. Nice. Yes. And then there's another one too, right? There's a bronze, which is third place. And did you ever lose? I did, a lot. I lost a lot of competitions, but I actually liked it better. Whenever I would make mistakes, it was so rewarding to come back into the gym and work on it and get better and like feel good inside. Oh, yes. Yeah. It's okay if you make mistakes. It's just an opportunity for growth. Yes. Okay, so let's sit down a little bit and stretch a little bit more before we get started. Okay. <laughs> I'm a little nervous. Oh, it's okay to be nervous. I get nervous a lot. You do? Yes. What do you do when you get nervous? I practice so that I feel more confident. I trust myself and I say, I can do this. Mm. And I ask my coach if I'm ready. I can do this. Yes. <laughs> now lean forward a little bit. Put your feet out in front of you. And touch your toes. Touch those toes. <laughs> I do think we're ready to get started. Oh, yay! Are you excited? I'm so excited. Okay, let's go do it. Here we go. <laughs> oh, wow! Oh, that was so cool. <laughs> Thank you. Can you teach me something on the beam? I can, but first we're going to start on the low beam and progressively work our way here. Great idea. Okay. Progressively means we take it one step at a time. Yes. Until you feel comfortable and much better. So we're gonna start at this end of the beam. Okay. <laughs> and you're gonna step up here. Okay, here I go. So the key to gymnastics is keeping all of your muscles squeezed as tight as possible. Squeeze, squeeze, squeeze. That helps us not fall off the beam. Right. If you do fall off the beam, it's okay. We'll just right. get back up and try again. Do you ever fall? I fall a lot, but with practice, you get more confident and better at your skills, so you fall less. Right. Okay, so arms will go straight out to the side. You can, 
I think you got this one. Oh, thanks. You kind of kind of look right down at the beam to make mm -hmm. sure you walk in a straight line. Okay. And we're just going to walk forward. Okay. Walk one, one two, two, three, three, three four. Four. Okay. Nice. Now we're going to walk backwards. Oh, that sounds tricky. So the thing with this is you're going to feel for the beam and then plant your foot. Make sure you look down. Feel for the beam. Feel for the plant. beam. And you're gonna go back till you feel the end of the beam. Okay. And when you feel the end, you're gonna stop. Okay. Keep going. <laughs> Keep feeling. Keep feeling. <gasps> there you are. Yay, I made so it to the stop. end. <laughs> so now we're gonna do flamingo walk. Okay. You're flamingo. gonna take a step. Hmm. Flamingo. Flamingo. Step. Flamingo. Stop, stop. <laughs> <laughs> Oh, there flamingo. we go. Step, flamingo. <laughs> Step, flamingo. Now, in gymnastics, we yes. always like to be barefoot uh -huh. because being able to feel the beam with our bare feet helps us have more control. It's Probably safer. makes it less slippery, too. Yes. So, one more. Flamingo. Good job. <laughs> okay, next skill, we're going to try a scale. Uh huh. I don't know why they call it this, but it's just the name. You're going to take your dominant side, which is usually the same side of your body, you write with. My right hand side. Yes. And for some reason, I think one side of your body is just usually stronger. So Ooh. we favor that in gymnastics. Okay. So you take your dominant side, mm -hmm. lean forward, arms out, and scale down. Whoa! And scale back up. Scale down. <gasps> and scale back up. Good job! <laughs> that takes a lot of strength and a lot of balance. Mm -hmm. Okay, last one. Are you ready? I'm ready. So with this one, we're actually gonna do a jump. <gasps> Whoa. Now, for all the kids watching, make sure you always have a coach with you and you don't do anything your coach doesn't say is safe for you. Okay. Okay? Is but it I safe, think you're Sean? ready. I think you're ready okay. for this. Coach says we're ready. <laughs> so when you jump, you wanna squeeze all your muscles super tight. You're gonna go down, jump, down. So okay. bend, straight, bend. And squeeze all those muscles together. Okay. Make sure you look at the beam too. There we go. Ready? Here we go. Whoa! It's okay. We can try it again. Count to ten and try again. <gasps> Will you count to ten with us? Oh, great. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. And try again. Okay, here we go. Remember, squeeze your muscles, mm -hmm. squeeze all everything together, and I think you got this one by yourself. Are you ready? Okay. Make sure you look at the beam. Ready? One, two, two three. three. Good job! Yeah. <laughs> okay. I think you're ready for the big beam. <gasps> okay, let's try the big beam. Let's go. So, with the big beam, I personally think the hardest part is just climbing up. So I'll help you climb up, and then I can hold your hand through the whole thing. Okay, it's really tall. I know. But it might feel tall, but nothing's changed. It's the same beam as down there, mm -hmm. and you are so confident and strong, I know you can do it up here. Thanks, Sean. Let's do it. <laughs> this is tricky. Whoa! Does it feel a little higher? Yeah, I feel a little nervous. Okay, remember, tell yourself, I can do this, take a deep breath, and know that your coach, myself, <laughs> believes you can do it too. I can do this. <sighs> deep breaths. And make sure if you're at home, you don't try any of this without a coach or without a gym, because safety is definitely first. Mm -hmm. Most Good important. Job. Okay, you've kind of mastered the forward walking. Let's try the backward. Okay. <laughs> okay, look at the beam, squeeze all your muscles, feel, feel your behind you and plant your foot. <laughs> Good job. Good job. Let's take two more steps. Okay. One. One. Two. two. Okay. Are you ready for your flamingos? Yes. Okay, let's try four this time. Four flamingos. Yeah. Here we go. One. Two. Three. Four flamingos. Good job. Stop, stop, hey. stop. Are you ready for your jump? I'm ready. Okay, so Whoa. here, I'm actually gonna get on the beam with you and okay. help you with your jump. 
So what we're gonna do, I'll show you. You feel my hands? Mm -hmm. I'm gonna do a small jump. Keep every muscle really tight, just like that. I'm gonna hold your hands. You use me for balance. You're gonna squeeze everything together. Go down, jump, down, and you're good. Okay. Ready? I'm ready. Okay, make sure you look at the beam. Ready? Mm -hmm. One, two, three. Whoa! Good job! <laughs> That's really good. That okay. was fun. You wanna try one more? Yeah. Okay, ready? One, two, three. <gasps> good job! Whoa! I'm so proud of you. Oh, I think you've shot. mastered the beam. Do you wanna to go to the floor? Okay. Let's go. Let's go. Oh, that beam was so fun! I was so proud of you. You did such a good job. Oh, thank you, Sean. <laughs> and the medal goes to... <gasps> Mika! <laughs> so, now that we're on the floor, I thought I could teach you another new skill. Oh, great! But first, can you do a cartwheel? Oh, yes. I love doing cartwheels. Do you mind showing me your cartwheel? I'd be happy to. Okay, let's see it. <laughs> That's a really good cartwheel. <laughs> Thank Since you, you already know how to do a cartwheel, mm -hmm. how about we take the next step and we learn a round off? Sounds great, a okay. round off. A round off is like a cartwheel, but instead of landing one foot at a time, you put your feet together. Whoa. Yeah, it's a foundational skill in gymnastics that you learn before you learn all the big flips, like flips and tricks. Oh, yes, yeah. that sounds great. Okay, so I'll show you first. Uh huh. The cartwheel, just like you did, is pretty simple like this. Mm -hmm. One foot after another. So what you're going to do is, when you're upside down, your uh -huh. feet will come together and land together. Kind of like this. Wow! <laughs> <laughs> and this might sound silly, but the floor, you want to push it away as hard as you can. Okay. That's what kind of gives you that speed to kind of jump off the floor. All right. Okay, are you ready to try one? Sure. Let's I'd give, give it, it a, a shot. It's okay if we make mistakes. We'll work on it. That's true. That's what I learned on the beam. Yes. <laughs> Let's see. Okay, here I go. Whoa. <laughs> Good job. Good job. So we also want to try to keep our legs as straight as we can. Okay. And a little trick for that is if you point your toes as hard as you can, your legs will naturally straighten. Really? Yeah. Okay, let's try one more time. Sure. That was a lot better. Oh, Yay! Good. I'm so proud of you again. That's another <laughs> new skill. Thank you so much, Sean. <laughs> of course. That was awesome. Good job. <laughs> <gasps> Whoa! <laughs> that was so cool. Thank you. Do you think I could do that someday? I think with a lot of practice and hard work, you definitely could. Oh, thank you for showing me all those skills. You did such a good job on the beam, on the floor. I was really proud of you. Oh, yeah. We had such a busy day today. We learned how to do <gasps> balancing walks on the beam and skills. <laughs> and we learned how to do a round off at the end of our cartwheels. Yeah. Oh, we also learned that there's a side of your body that's usually stronger than the other side. Yeah. And that's the side we usually use in gymnastics. Oh, yeah. <laughs> well, that's the end of this video. But if you want to watch more of my videos, all you have to do is search for my name. Can you spell my name with me? <laughs> M-E-E-K-A-H, Mika. Can you spell my name with me? S H A W N Sean! <laughs> Bye, friends! Oh, I'd like to keep practicing, please. Me too. <laughs>
Let's count. One, two, three, four. There are squares all over this floor. Hmm, I know. I'm only gonna hop on the green squares. Ready? Green, green, green. <gasps> Whoa, look at this. Do you know what this is? It's a basketball hoop. And I see basketballs on the wall. Will you count the basketballs with me? Okay, one, two, three, four, five, six basketballs. <gasps> and I see four more right here. Wow, they're all different colors. There's one, two, three, four basketballs. Wow, these are so fun. Do you know what basketball is? It's a really fun sport. You take the basketball and you want to get it in the basket or the hoop. <laughs> hmm, I wonder if I could get any of these balls in the hoop. I'm gonna try my best. Okay, here we go. Basketball star Mika going for the hoop. Oh, I missed it. That's okay, I'm gonna keep practicing. Now we're gonna try the green basketball. Oh, see, I was trying to use the backboard to help me get it in, and it still didn't work. Well, I have two balls left. The yellow basketball, maybe this is the one. <gasps> yeah, this calls for a 10 second dance party. Yeah! <laughs> Should I try the last one? Maybe this time I'll do a slam dunk. Ready? Here we go. Whoa! Wow! I got the skills. <laughs> I'm just being silly. <laughs> Can you think of another sport where you would need to use a ball? Hmm. <gasps> a soccer ball. Yeah, soccer is another really fun sport where you use a ball. I wonder if we can find a soccer goal anywhere. Come on. I found one, a soccer goal. We have our soccer ball and our soccer goal, so now we can really play soccer. <laughs> Check out the soccer ball. See, it's black and white, and there's two different shapes on it. This shape is a pentagon. Will you count the sides with me? Okay, one, two, three, four, five. A pentagon has five sides. And this shape is a hexagon. <laughs> Let's count together. One, two, three, four, five, six. Six sides. So in soccer, you wanna get the ball into the goal, but you can't use your hands. You can use your feet, you can use your knees. Hmm, wait a second. There's more balls over here. I wonder if I can get all of them into the goal. Let's see. Oh, we saw something like this earlier. It's a tiny basketball. Do you know what color it is? That's right, it's orange. I'm gonna kick it in the goal. Here we go. Boop, <laughs> oh yeah, goal. And what? <laughs> this tiny one looks like a ball pit ball. Do you know what color that is? Yellow, <laughs> one of my favorites. Let's see if I can kick this tiny little ball into the goal. <gasps> Boop, yes, goal. And we have this really bouncy ball. And it's blue. All right, in you go. Yeah, whoa, that was a big one. Goal. And another basketball, but this one's a different color. Do you know what color it is? Red, oh right. That was too light of a kick, but don't worry, I have it in me. Here we go. Goal, see, I knew I could do it. And here's another really bouncy ball, and it's yellow. All right. Three, two, one, goal! 
Do you know what this color is? Oh yeah, it's red. Okay. Go! <laughs> and now is the time for the official soccer kick. I'm using a soccer ball. I'm using a soccer goal. One. Go! I love soccer. <laughs> Thanks so much for playing with me. I wonder what else is here to play with. Let's go. Hey, look at these colorful blocks. Huh. They're kind of set up like bowling pins. And bowling is another sport where you use a ball. There's usually 10 pins for bowling. Will you count with me? Okay. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, Nine, ten. This is the perfect setup for bowling. The pins don't usually look like this. These are rectangles. Do you know what a rectangle is? It's a shape with four sides and it has two long sides and two short sides. Let's count them. One, two, three, four. Yeah, that's a rectangle. Hmm. And usually you have a bowling ball, which is really heavy. <laughs> but I don't think there's any bowling balls here. Hey, but there's some balls over here. I wonder what kind of ball would knock these blocks over. Hmm, you could try, oh, <laughs> look at this little one. Do you know what color this is? Blue, yeah, let's see if it will knock over these blocks. Nope. <laughs> what about this one? This is a fun yellow ball. All right, let's see if this one will work. Whoa. <laughs> wow, that's a really bouncy ball. It bounced right off the pin. Let's see how many I knocked over. One, two, three, four, five, six. Hey, that's pretty good. I'll set them back up. We can try another ball. Awesome. Ooh, what about this basketball? I wonder if it's too bouncy to knock any of these blocks over. Let's see. Oh, oh, oh. <laughs> yep, I knocked over. One, two, three, four, five. <laughs> We have one ball left to try, the soccer ball. Let's see if the soccer ball can knock any blocks over. Okay, here we go. Three, two, one. Wow, I knocked over. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight blocks. Hmm, I wonder what else we could do to knock these blocks down. I have an idea. What if instead of bowling, we played Mika Bowl? <laughs> and instead of using a ball, I'll use me. <laughs> okay, set these up and I'm gonna find a way to go down and knock these blocks over. What can I do? I could dance, I could crawl, I could run, or I could be one of my favorite dinosaurs, a T-Rex. Are you ready for the Mika Bowl? Rawr, 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 rawr. Yeah, I did it. I knocked all the pins over, and in bowling when that happens, it's called a strike. Strike! Five, six, seven, eight, and now it's time to celebrate. Rawr, rawr, rawr. <laughs> Come on, let's keep playing. Rawr, 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 rawr. <laughs> Whoa, there are a lot of shapes here. <gasps> Come look at this one. This is an octagon. Do you know how many sides it has? Well, let's count and find out. One, two, three, 
four, five, six, seven, eight. Eight sides. Wow, that's a really cool shape. Hmm. Oh, look at these little chairs. If you look at the back of them, you can see a square. A square has four sides, see? One, two, three, four. And there's one, two, three, four squares. But if you look even closer, when all of them are together, it makes one big rectangle. And makes for a really comfy couch. <laughs> Whoa, do you see this? It's a giant circle. Huh, it kind of looks like a cake or a pie. Whoa, look at this big slice of cake. Mmm. <gasps> Mmm, mm-hmm, very tasty. <laughs> wow, there's more shapes over here. I see a big purple rectangle, see? There's the two long sides and the two short sides. <laughs> oh, and if you look to the side here, I see a pink triangle, see? One, two, three. Do you see any other shapes? Yeah, a circle, a red circle. And this ball is here too. Should I throw the ball through the circle? Okay, let's do it. All right, ready? So long, ball. Woo! <laughs> hey, I see some really special circles over there. Come on. Look at all of these bubbles. These are the cool circles that I was talking about. <laughs> bubbles are so fun. Hey, you know what I just realized? Every ball we played with today was a circle. A basketball, a soccer ball, a bouncy ball, a ball pit ball. <laughs> so many circles today. Can you remember any other shapes that we saw? We saw a hexagon, a pentagon, an octagon, a rectangle, a triangle, a square. There are so many shapes all around us all the time. Isn't that cool? <laughs> well, this is the end of this video, but if you wanna watch more of my videos, all you have to do is search for my name. Will you spell my name with me? <laughs> cool. M-E-E-K-A-H. Mika. <laughs> well, I'm gonna keep playing with these bubbles. See you next time. Bye. Hey, it's me, Mika. And today I'm at Montebello Barnyard Zoo in Montebello, California. <laughs> and I heard they have animals here <gasps> and a fairy village. <laughs> So I'm going to be a fairy and grant wishes to any animals or fairies I see. I have my fairy wings on and my magic fairy wand. Will you help grant wishes with me? Awesome! Hmm, let's go find that fairy village. <laughs> hey, horsey, I'm Mika. Nice to meet ya. <laughs> We're looking for fairies. <gasps> hey, should we grant this horse a wish? <laughs> yeah! Okay, I need some space. Mika's here with the plan. Your fairy wish is my command. <laughs> Look, horse food. <laughs> here you go, horsey. Your wish is granted. <laughs> okay, see ya. I haven't seen any fairies yet, but check it out. Goats. Hello, goats. I'm Mika, nice to meet ya. <laughs> Ooh, did you know goats have four stomachs? <laughs> yeah, that's why they're so hungry. <laughs> Do you know where the fairies are? Okay, let's keep going east. Bye, goats. <laughs> Haven't found those fairies yet. <gasps> oh, but I have a great idea. Check it out, a tractor. Let's go on a ride to the fairy village. Hey, I'm Mika, nice to meet ya. 
<laughs> Can you take me east to the fairy village? Yeah. Oh, great! Come on, let's take a seat. This looks like a great seat for a tractor ride. Oh, here we go! Wow! There's so many animals. Hi, llamas! Oh, look! There are three llamas. <laughs> They look so cozy and all that fur. Oh, and look, an emu. That's a flightless bird from Australia. <laughs> oh, 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 it's a bumpy ride. <laughs> oh, and look, some horses. Hello, horse. <gasps> look, a merry-go-round. Looks like so much fun. Okay, hocus focus. We're looking for fairies. That could be pretty fun. Maybe later. I think we're getting closer to the fairy village. Oh, I can't wait to meet so many fairies. Yeah! We finally made it to the fairy village! We did it! We did it! We never ever quit it! We did it! <laughs> Great job! Whoa! Check it out! Look at this! Oh, it's a little forest for fairies! And look! A table and chair for their yummy lunches! Oh! And they got lots of fresh fruits and vegetables! <laughs> oh, and a bridge over glittery water. And a squirrel. <laughs> Hello, squirrel. Let's keep exploring. Whoa. Look, a door. Hmm, I wonder where it leads. Let's knock on it. Knock, knock, knock. Is anybody home? <laughs> oh, just a little gnome. Hello. <laughs> oh, and look, more fairies. Hello, little fairies. I'm Mika, nice to meet you. <laughs> Since you're always doing so much for people, like sprinkling fairy dust and collecting teeth and gems, do you need anything? <gasps> oh, you would like a home? <laughs> Lucky for you, I'm really crafty. I know just what you need. Mika's here with the plan. Your fairy wish is my command. <laughs> Coming right up. <laughs> Let's go. <gasps> we need to build our fairies a little home. <gasps> hmm. I have just the trick. Mika's here with the plan. Your every wish is my command. <gasps> Whoa! Look at this house. This is a perfect house for a fairy. Are you ready to paint our fairy house? <laughs> yeah, me too. Wow, there are so many colors for us to choose. Blue, green, like grass, pink, purple, and yellow. And check it out. My two favorite colors are together. We should definitely start with those. Grab my paintbrush. Oh, do you know what this color is? <laughs> That's right, pink. Dip it in water first and dip it in the purple paint. This will be such a cozy home for the fairies. <gasps> I hope they like it. <laughs> okay, let's do yellow next. Yellow, just like the sun. That looks so pretty. <laughs> and bright too. Okay, we got the front. Let's work on the roof. I think I'd like the roof to be blue, just like the sky. Let's do pink with our pink paintbrush. Whoa, we're 
we're almost done. Check it out. Oh, such a beautiful fairy home. Let's do the sides now. Hmm, what color haven't we done yet? <gasps> green. Let's put some green on our house. Dip my brush. Check it out. This is such a beautiful, colorful fairy home. <laughs> Let's go see if they love their new house. <laughs> Hello, little fairies. We made you a beautiful, colorful home. <laughs> Hope you like it. What's that? You love it? Oh, that's great news. Do you have everything you need? <gasps> oh, you would like us to help you collect gems? Oh, okay. I got it. Mika's here with the plan. Your every wish is my command. Wow! Great idea. Let's go collect some gems for our fairy friends. See you soon. We made it. <laughs> Let's go get some stones for our fairy friends. <laughs> oh, look. These are the different stones we can find. Amethyst and calcite. Whoa, I wonder how many stones we'll find. Ooh, water. All right, I have my mining tray. Do you know what this color is? That's right, it's yellow, one of my favorite colors. And it's round, just like a steering wheel. <laughs> this helps us sift through all the dirt. So we get rid of what we don't want, the dirt, and then we get our crystals inside. Ready to give it a try? <laughs> Great. Whoa, check out this dirt. Check it out. <laughs> Look how many gems we got. <gasps> Ooh, I think this one is rose quartz. And it's pink. Pretty. <gasps> Check out this one. Wow. <gasps> and this one is black. <laughs> and little. Let's count how many gems we found. Ready? One, two, three. Four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven. Eleven gems for our fairy friends. Let's go give them to our fairy friends. <laughs> Here we go. Don't worry, little fairies. We collected all the gems so you can rest and relax. <laughs> You get a gym, and you get a gym, little froggy. <laughs> and you get a gym, too. <laughs> oh, would you like a gym, too? Okay, I have plenty to share. Oh, I love giving. It makes me feel so happy. <laughs> would you like a gym, too, little gnome? <laughs> okay, there you go. And you get a gym, too. Hope you're enjoying your new home. <gasps> oh, check it out. Look at this little fairy. She's taking a nap. <laughs> Let's leave her a crystal for when she wakes up. Sleep tight, little fairy. <laughs> that was so much fun being a fairy with you today. We got to pet some animals and feed them lunch. Oh, we got to mine for gems and we paid in a fairy house. <laughs> well, that's the end of this video. But if you want to watch more of my videos, all you have to do is search for my name. Can you spell my name with me? <laughs> M-E-E-K-A-H, Mika. Wait, I forgot to grant one more wish, mine. Hmm. Oh, I would like to ride this merry-go-round. 
Mika's here with the plan. Your fairy wish is my command. <gasps> Bye-bye!